Let's check out these uh, genius loopholes. Um, so there's a, a guy in or a guy in, or a service in Maine where they sell weed. And they charge a fee for your lost weed, I guess, and deliver it to you. And they're called the Trailblazers. Like the Portland Trailblazers. They really blaze some trails. They probably smoke some of that shit <laughs> before they deliver it to you. <laughs> Best of the battles. After the Beatles fired drummer Pete Best in favor of Ringo Starr, he formed in a new band and released the album Best of the Beatles. To play on his own name. This led to disappointing from fans who brought the album without reading the track listing. <laughs> what the heck? Mathematician, pianist Tom Lehner invented the Jello shot to comment rules against alcohol in the army. He was banned for bringing alcoholic beverages to Christmas party. They mix vodka with jello. The alcohol was no longer a beverage, so he technically didn't break any rules. <laughs> That's funny. Hey man, we're just trying to get dirt again. Oh, that's funny. Although Kellogg has been sued several times for no fruit being presented in Fruit Loops, judges have ruled that the cereal is called Brat Lops. Couldn't reasonable be expected to contain real fruit because fruit is not a real word. That's true. Wait, this is French loops first. <laughs> what? I just noticed it even says that. Fruit. F R O O T. Like fruit. Almost like Groot. My brother once yelled at. Yelled last. Yelled. Oh my god, I can't talk. Listen. One to jump in the pool is gay. The last one in the. Last one to jump in the pool is gay. <laughs> and then jumped into the pool. However, I figured out that if I did not jump in, then technically he would be the last one in the pool. And he's still gay to this day. <laughs> I know there's some people that hide that they're gay and they just uh, make fun of other people. And call them gay and stuff. I just recently just called a faggot the other day for no reason. Cause uh, I don't know, sometimes at work I talk in like a nice voice, and I can't get out of it too. I can't get into my regular voice, but I had this like little feminine nice voice, and someone called me a faggot for it. <laughs> I'm definitely not no faggot. George Washington moved his slaves in and out of Philadelphia every six months to avoid them taking advantage of a law that meant slaves residing in the city longer than half a year could claim freedom. Oh. I don't think about slaves. This, this whole thing's messed up, man. According to Muslim law, it is legal to get married temporary just for sex. These marriages can be as short as one hour. Dang, hour marriages? Imagine. I don't even know what a real marriage is. Hour marriages. You can get married 24 times in one day. That's crazy. Oh, imagine doing that. See if you can get married 24 different times in the one day. <laughs> I wonder what the world record is for getting married in one day. Just kidding. Please, hopefully no one does that. Disney created its own in order to bypass state 
and local laws during the construction of Walt Disney World. <sighs> by, do <laughs> by doing this, they no longer need to get permission to start a new construction. What? Disney can just create their own laws? Duh. Business plans are money. <laughs> Those WikiHow illustrations. No. <sighs> WikiHow hired freelancers who started making thousands of picks for as low as 40 cent per one. Mostly drawing on the stock photo, Google started to see them as original and positioned WH higher. <laughs> Wonder how much money they actually got for these 40 cent picks. A lot of people do wiki house a lot. I've read some. Paul Simon listed the song Faking It. That's me. Oh my god! Wake your ass up. <laughs> His radio station would play anything listed at over three minutes long. Wow. Stupid. Here for a beer. Wait. This restaurant is only allowed to sell beer if someone buys food. Beer for beer menu. <laughs> they gotta buy fries. It's only a dollar. And twenty one percent of our normal basket. Solo onion ring. The only hoop you need to jump through for this beer. <laughs> We're in a pickle. One deep fried pickle. One cheese puff ball. They usually come in a pair, but Wolf has the other one. This menu is only a quarter sheet of paper because, well, you know why. Oh, wow, they actually did all that. That's true. <laughs> in 1970, a gay man discovered a loophole in the Minnesota law that said gay marriage wasn't le illegal as long as officials allowed it. He then changed his name legally from Jack to Pat Lynn and fooled officials into thinking he was a woman successfully getting a gay marriage license. Hey, it's whatever works, man. And into a girl's name. That's, that's kind of cool. That's smart, man. <laughs> Party on Garth. Question. SNL paid live audience members as employees after season premiere. New York State guidelines still prohibit ticket events, but the show found a way around the rules. <laughs> but the oh, I remember this? When you turn the subway upside down, it's 11 inches, not 12. After complaints that their foot long sandwich was. 11 inches long, Subway claimed that the Subway footlong is registered trademark as a descriptive name for the sub and not measurement of length. But it is 12 inches, it's just, it's just the bottom part is 11 when you flip it over. Did that guy or girl get money for doing that too? 11 inches? The one dollar bill. Kentucky passed a law. All public schools must hang God we trust sign to skirt around this law. One school hung up a framed one dollar bill. Hey, it says it. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Full nudity has been banned unless this displays has artist merit. The club beat this law by offering pencils and a paper to the customers so they can draw the strippers. This became completely legal and allowed them to stay open. Oh, what? 
testers like a jaw strippers. Oh, I'm <laughs> Prostitution is illegal in Japan, but is not illegal to sleep with an acquaintance you met while paying for another service, such as using their bath. Brothels in Japan are called soaplands. <laughs> what the hell? The ice cream sundae was created in the late 1800s. The bypass laws that allowed ice cream sodas on Sunday. They instead served ice cream with the syrup of your choice without soda, thereby complying with the law. Ice cream sodas? Hmm. Ice cream soda ban? That's weird. Ronald Reagan declared ketchup a vegetable. The law requires school lunches to at least include one vegetable. <laughs> the United States government didn't have to spend more money on schools that way. Damn, so all the schools just, their only vegetable is ketchup? Oh, wow, wow. O.J. Simpson has arthritis in his hands. So during his trial, his lawyers told him to stop taking his medication. But his hand would swell because of this. The glove didn't fit his hands. And he was acquitted. Wow. So he did do it. I heard stories about this. Like this whole lawsuit. Isn't, like, the Kim Kardashian family, like, the the dad or someone was, like, the lawyer? That's how they got all that money. In this case, in particular. Um, I don't know if he killed his wife. It has a tag still on it. It's funny. Um, it was so long ago. Been like a little kid, I wasn't even born yet when all this happened to. This is a crazy scandal. It's crazy how good of a football player he was, too. The Flintstones were the first married couple to be shown sharing a bed on TV. This is the Hayes Code. Couples were not allowed to be shown sharing a bed. Since the Flintstones were not technically human. He didn't break any rules. They're not human? Where are they? I mean, he has a job and he has a pet. He's a kid. They're not human. Just because of like the Stone Age or whatever, they're not human? That's confusing. We were having the Flintstones. I haven't heard about the Flintstones in a long time. The Bishop of Orlando is also a Bishop of the Moon. Due to the canon law that says who discovered territory would fall under the Bishopric from when, when it's discovering Expedition of Partridge. Therefore, the largest Catholic deceased at over 14 million square miles. Dang, I think is that huge? Looks pretty cool. Oh my god! Refreshing little lifts, Tic Tac. Tic Tacs are labeled in the US containing zero sugar because of US federal regulations state that if a single serving contains less than 0.5 grams of sugars, it's allowable to express the amount of sugar in the serving as zero. Each Tic Tac just weighs under 0.5. Wait, what? A lot of stuff containing zero sugar actually has some sugar in it. Wow, that's... All the sugar-free stuff isn't really... 
non sugar free. It has a little bit. Knew it. In the US, slippers are taxed as dramatically lower rate than other types of shoes. Take advantage of this. Comfort adds a thin layer of felt to the bottom of the soles of sneakers in order to classify them as slippers. This allows them to pay as little as 3% instead of 37% in taxes. Uh, that's true. Converses are small. So it's a slipper shoe. No, know that. I've never actually bought a pair of Converse before. Ah, I, I just never liked it. This looks looks too plain for me. I'm always a uh, a Jordan shoe kind of guy or a Adidas, like like Jordans or Adidas, and and some Nikes. I guess I like Nikes too. Well, I guess Jordans are Nikes. Never Converse though. When Minnesota banned smoking in the public buildings in 2007, one bar noticed that the actors were exempt if playing a character on stage. He declared his bar a theater, and then he, his, his customers were now putting on continuous performance. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, he could have made a YouTube channel just uh, recording his customers smoking and acting. Damn, this video ended up being 60 minutes. But, uh, yeah, subscribe. These are pretty, pretty cool little facts about people finding loopholes. Alright.